All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, the man just come and talked to me, the one mowing the grass, and I asked him about the flags, and he said they lower them for the military, and then they put it, they had them down this morning and put them right back up. And I said, do you don't lower them for the attack on our country? And he said, no, we lower them for the military. So they do not lower the flags here at this cemetery for the, the veterans, I mean for the people, for the 9-11 attack. So I don't know what's up with that. But anyways, guys, we're going to get right back to it. This is a different garden. It's up front, more closer to the office. We have a, we have a uh, Bible out there in the middle right there a big bible we'll be checking out we'll see what kind of gravestones we got here guys right here yeah let's see who we got we're going to check you out here we have given that's a different name we hadn't seen given we have linda given 1949 and then we have george 1947 so either both of them still alive, but they just didn't return back to here. Then we have Hempford or Hint 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 Horn. I'm sorry, Hint Horn. Dorothy May, 1913 to 1979. We have Ida Clayton, 1911 to 1999. Then we have and they are in the middle of mowing on their behalf. I will say they are blowing them off. They just ain't got to this yet. We have Shirley, 1932. We have Melvin Jr., 1928 to 2022. All right, let's bounce around a little bit. We don't want to go right in the road because then we won't get different names. So let's see who we got here. We have, whoop, go turn around there. Whoa, this is a different name. I've not heard of this name. Gorgrad, Gorgrads, Gorgrads, I think is how you pronounce it. It's Ruby H, 1920 to 2014. And we have Arthur, 1903 to 1979. Then we have a phone going crazy. We don't have a phone going crazy. We have a gimbal going crazy. Then we have Dog, Dog, Dogret, Dogret, or Dogret. It's either Dogret or Dogret. We have Zelma. 1891 to 1993, and we have Noel, something like that. Uh, 19, I mean 1895 to 1981 on that one. This thing's got to be stupid. That's going up and down, guys. It aggravates it. Then we have Smith again. We have Owen Alfred. He's a private in the first class in World War II, December the 12th, 1918 to September the 18th, 2017. I mean, uh, 2007. Then we have Dolores L. Smith, beloved wife, December the 22nd, 1918 to May the 18th, 2020. Oh, wow. Then we have Christ. We're going to do Christ. There's Christ. Shirley J. Christ. 1936, 2011, and then we have Richard <coughs> DC. Hold on a minute, my voice is changing again, guys. Sorry. 2008. There it goes again. Oh Lord, I feel like crap though, guys. Ooh, let's see where we're gonna go next. Then we have. Uh, oh, what's his name? Cut lip. Cut lip. There's Cutlip. I never heard of that name before either. Cutlip right here. Rosemary, a Cutlip. 1931 to 2011. And Harold W. 1930. Wow. Name Cutlip. Huh. Then we have Simpson. And we know all heard that name before. Right here. Simpson. That's Richard. 1931 to 2009. And Mary. 1935, 2002. He was a loving husband, father, and grandfather. And the Lord is their shepherd. And they, he has, she was a loving wife, mother, and grandmother. All right. Then we have Willie. And this one. 
We have Elma, 1889 to 1978. And we have Wayne, 1883 to 1971 on this one right here, guys. All right, we're making our way over to the big Bible. And the grass hasn't been cut here yet. Part of it has and part of it ain't. They're still working on it. Then we have Chandler right here. We have Chandler. We have E. Diane, 1947. And we have Clyde Debbie in 1924 to 1990. He's in World War II. Then we have Bonnie Jean Chandler, May the 4th, 1927, to May the 15th, 2012. Then we have Eric Johnson, July the 29th, 1996, to July the 29th, 1996. I don't want to come back and give that baby no flowers or nothing. Wow. That is sad. It's heartbreaking, I'm sure. But being a kid, I don't know. I would probably be here every day. I don't know. You can tell the difference in the old vases, too. Because years ago, I think the older ones used to be square. And the round ones now, like these. These right here, like the early 70 ones, they were square. See the little vases, how they're square now. And nowadays, they're around like this. Uh, if I can get it over there, right there on the bottom of that one. See it? So, yeah. Uh, here's one that's got the vase up. Most of the time, they get the vases get broke off of them. And they're tore all to pieces by then. But, yeah, you got stone right here. You got uh, William, 1909 to 1974. Then you got Untry, uh, 1910 to 2006 on there. So there's that one. All right. Then you got Coops on this one. He was in the Army, Charles was, 1921 to 1981, and Margaret, 1928 to 1968. Then you have, what, he's. I think it's Heaves, how you pronounce it. You have Lois. Uh, Lois, 1910 to 1994. Then you have Easton, 1905 to 1984. On that stone right there, guys. Then you got Virginia M. Coops. She was a beloved wife, 1925 to 2002. And John W. Coops, senior. He was a private in the first, uh, private, private first class in the Army in World War II, July 22nd, 1924, to April 12th, 2015. On that one. All right, guys, let's see what we got over here. And this is where I filmed that big Bible once before when I put it down in my short. Right here. It's the Lord's Prayer. Right here. For everybody who wants to see it. There it is right there, guys, the Lord's Prayer. Right. Yeah, it's about the best I can do on it, guys. There it is. Very cool. Very neat. All right, let's move on. Those guys are done for the day. Done for the day. Flags are back up. They were down partial day for military. That's it. That's what the man told me. That's what his supervisor told him to do, put them back up. So they put them back up. I'm not saying they didn't lower them, but they didn't keep them down all day. This is Stillman, Molly K, 1885 1934, and Ben F, 1889 to 1965. This is Hazel A, 1913 to 1989. And this is Carl L, uh, Carl R. 1924 to 1991. Their last name was Green. All right. A lot of military in this one. Oh, sorry, my back just popped. Low grade and it pops you back when you step in them holes. How do I get too far from my car because I don't feel too great and if I had to get to my car quick then I, I'll be in trouble. Know what I mean, guys? This is a cool looking one. Right here for a five year old. This is Scott J. Rhodes. 
1972 to 1977. Little roads here. Rest in peace, little one. I wonder how they done the children one. I'm glad I found one. That's why I'm looking around just to see, find different ones, guys. Here's Mac, Mac Williams. That's the name we had and had. It's going to be John. 1921 to 1988 in Orlean. 1922 to 2020 on that one there. Then we have Land. Who I have no idea. Here's one. I have no idea what that name is. But it's A. Pearl, 1906 to 1980. And then it's Carl W. 1897 to 1985. Then we got Klein. That's an easy one. <laughs> we have Dana, 1899 to 1979. And then we have Virgil, 19, I mean 1896 to 2002. All right. Then we have Longdorf, Blake, 1911 to 2012. And then we have Geneva, 1914 to 1999. All right. Excuse me. Then we have W. Wright Lewis, March 25th, 1927 to March the 14th, 2017. We have Maryland, September 29th, 1928 to July 24th, 2020. They have new flowers there. See the flowers? Then we have right again. We have Wayne C. 1895 to 1984. And we have Edna. 1898 to 1971. On that old stone right there. Or marker right there. There I have said stone again. <coughs> then we have this one. This one's pretty cool. Right here. It's W. I mean William W. Galt. Galt or Galt. January 29th, 1928, to December the 20th, uh, 2000. And I like this one. I think they're the same, though. They are. And it's Harold E. Gelt. June the 6th, 1935, to October the 7th, 2018. He had new flyers, and the other one didn't, though. Hmm. Then we have Lin Linda Mayo. Uh, 1949 to 2015. Then we have Rock Brockaway. We have Roger D. December the 18th, 1933 to January the 11th, 2021. We have Betty L. February 27th, 1934 to February the 6th, 2021. We have Dennis D. March 21st, 1953 to January 18th, 2012. On that one right there, guys. Pretty cool stones, or markers, I mean. Dang it, I quit saying stones. I quit saying them. But this is another garden. We're going to move to somewhere else just in a minute. Just wanted to show you some in this garden. We're going to move on around some more. I like moving around and showing you these different things. So yeah, give me just a minute. We're gonna go back around the other way. All right, hang on just a minute, guys. Let me see if I can pause this thing. Sorry about that, guys. One of the guys left a blower sitting out in the yard and I picked it up and turned it into the office so nobody would take it. So yeah, they have all this area, what I was gonna show you. All this field, right? See this field from way back there where you see the graves way back yonder by the trees, way back in that corner. They have all that area right through here. And all this field out through here is still to bury people in. Look at all that, guys. All the way around to the mausoleum. There's the mausoleum. That's where we're going to take a big hat now. So, hey, we're down in the mausoleum area. We're going to do a few more grays here in a minute, but we're going to do, show you the mausoleum area here in a moment. Well, we could do the grays first. How, how many minutes we got left? Uh, 10 minutes. 
Well, 16 actually. Let's do a few more grays first. Then we'll, then we'll take a peek at the mausoleum if we can. All right, let's see what we can do here first. Let's check out a few more stones, get a few more names. We're in the front of the cemetery now. This is the whole cemetery up there, guys. That's what I'm saying. There's no way I can record all this. Too many stones, I mean, t markers between there and the whole way around through here. And I'm just one person that, see, that goes way back to that building back over there, too. The whole way back over there. And the whole way down through there, the whole way past this building, that's the office. And it goes out through yonder. So, yeah, pretty good size area, guys. All right, let's see what names we got here. We have Martins. We have William Martin, 1915 to 1992. We have Beulah L. Martin, September the 28th, 1920 to April the 9th, 2013. Then we have Holland on this one. We have Wilma, 1918 to 2005. And then we have Harvey, 1904 to 1969. Then we have Galloway. Galloway, Galloway, it's either Galloway or Galloway, however you want to pronounce it. It's Florence, 1914 to 1995, and then it's Robert E., 1914 to 1999. This is a newer one here. These are the newer ones. This is to like the type I set when I was working at the cemetery years ago. More like this one, except for the doubles, and they were double. This is K. M. Rogers. 1942 to 2023 on that one. Good flowers. All right. Then we have, if this thing quit going crazy, we have Swineford on this one right here. It's going to be Ro Swineford. Rosetta Swine, 1903 to 1999. And then we have Richard, 1912 to 1997. Hold on a minute, guys. Let me pause you just a moment. All right, guys. He was just curious on what we was doing, and I thought we were recording for YouTube. This is Martin. It's going to be Betty M, 1924 to 2002. It's going to be Donald, uh, 1917 to 2002. And there they are. And Donald was a, in World War II. He was a captain in the World War II, guys. There it is. Right there. All right. Then we got over, overhauled. We got overhauled on this one. Right here, we got overhauled. It's going to be Mary E, 1915 to 1970, and it's going to be Robert L, 1911 to 1992. Then we got Sandra, Doyle Demslow, loving wife and mother and grandmother, November the 28th, 1946. Then you got Richard. Right here, Leroy Dinslow. He was in the U.S. Navy in Vietnam, November the 21st, 1942, to November the 21st, 2014. Wow. Oh, guys, we died or something. Let's see what happened here. Uh-oh. One, two. There he goes. Sometimes it gets a little moody. All right. Then we got Sloop. I must say it's Sloop. Hey, I'm on camera. Hi, guys. I ain't supposed to be, but hi. Uh, <laughs> Here I look like crap and feel like crap. And he wants to throw me on camera. You believe that crap? Here's our next one. Sloop. What is it? Uh, Osi? 1918 to 2003. And Robert C, 1918 to 2003. Then we have uh, James. We have James right here on this one. All right there's James. It's Bonnie J, 1923 to 2014, and John W, 1927 to 1996. All right. That sun's getting hot. You can tell these have been in there a while. They're sunk in the ground a while. They're a lot more. You know what I mean? The newer ones are more level, and this is more sunk down. 
just by looking across it see how they got them dipped in the ground and pivoted in the ground more here which is the best way we actually they won't hit them with the mower but the only problem with that is when someone forgets and leaves one of the a vases up and they hit the vases all the time to break the vases but anyways guys I'm gonna end this out in here though I think I've read enough for you give you an idea of what they look like and the flats you know the the markers hey I said it this time well we're gonna check out the little mausoleum part over here first it's a pretty nice cemetery overall but see right here you got Williams people donated their headstones and uh, buried them here and had the benches made up where you can sit and relax Here's Ronald L, 1949, and Shirley L, 1953. They were married June the 12th, 1976. Give me just a minute, guys. Sorry about that, guys. I had to catch my breath a moment. <laughs> All right. Here we have coming in, we have a family right here. Right here. Family together. Little Morio thing right there, set up. And this little tiny mausoleum thing, or stone, however you want to call this. There it is. All right. Then look at this one, guys. This one's cool. I like this one. This is pretty nice. Right here, look at this. Is that not cool? That's very cool right there. That's Walter C. November the 6th, 1935 to January 21st. 2023 amazing grace and this is barbara j february the 13th 1938 on this side that's not cool that's awesome and then i'm sure there's gonna be more family members maybe put on around right here and maybe right here and again who knows that could be the husband and wife and that's it but there it is guys very awesome all right we've got a beautiful walkway through here I don't know what they've made it out of, but it's pretty cool. And they left it open where you can extend it. So if they try to do more on down through here, you got three pieces right there that come together in different ways. And you can tie into it and continue it on. Very cool. Then we have a reed, a red, on this one right here. The bench. It's Bobby Lee, 1949 to 2013. And what, Lalas? Uh, 1943. They're in God's care. Very cool. All right, and they're not supposed to really get on the grass, but that's cars, not walking. But anyways, here's our next one. It's Huckleberry. And they've hit this one, see how it's moved around? It's Robert L., 1950, and Bonnie J., 1946. They were married June the 12th, 2012. Then you got Zimple on this one. You got David M, 1966, 2016, and Karen A, 1967, 2018. Then we have right here, we have Midginger, we have Leslie, June the 6th, 1943. We have Helen. September the 23rd, 1948, and we have Bump Change, December the 4th, 1966. Then we have Family Together, again, another one of them, right here. It's Candance, Paige, Atkins, June the 24th, 2000, to July the 16th, 2022. To know her was to love her. Then we have Carmen Lane, uh, June the 24th, 2000. Somebody left a bottle of whiskey. I don't know if she drunk. That'll be her business, not mine. All right. Next, we have this little box right here. Stone. This is a neat looking stone. I guess it's a stone. And it says gray on it. It says May Ann, 11... 11, 18, 1949 
the 414-2011 on there right there. So that's pretty cool. All right, all right. now we'll come over. Well, we got one more bench. I better show you the one more bench. And it says, forever loved. Right here. It's Lois A. Buck. 1940 to 2018. She was a beloved mother, grandmother, and a greater grandmother. Right there. Beautiful bench. All right. All right. Next, we got that mausoleum. Right here. Pretty good sized mausoleum. Right here. <coughs> Excuse me. Whew. And they have three different types right here in this mausoleum. So, which is pretty cool. And I'm going to show them to you. Right after I show you this cool looking placards right here. This was the Edward R. Kloss. He was the last World War I veteran of Ashland County. And he was buried here 11-7 in 1989. Donated by Ashland County Memorial Park. Right there. All right. Then, this is on this day. Is the reason why I show you this. Look at this beautiful stone right here. Somerset County, PA, New York, New York, and Washington, D.C. Though blurred eyes, we find the strength and courage to soar beyond the moment. We look to the future, knowing we can never forget the past. God bless America. September the 11th, 20. 2001 I mean there it is guys all right now let's get to the mausoleum before this thing goes crazy there's the mausoleum guys the front of it okay you have outside boxes right here where you can be inserted right here right there in these little boxes on this wall right here I don't know what they cost then you have inside ones on the wall. I don't know if you can see it too well because of the sun and the glare. But there's some inside as well. And there. Alright. Now we're gonna go around the side. And this is all flags for the military up through here. Around the sidewalk. But then when you have also for the ones who want outside, you can get a big outside like this. Right here. All in this one mausoleum right here, guys. Is that not options or what? But there it is. And that's pretty well going to wrap this video up for today, too. But that's the rest of that field, guys. Look how big that is. I mean, you've got this whole field they can still bury in. A lot of markers, I mean, markers, yes, can be buried in here. A lot of people. Anyways, please share, like, and subscribe to the channel. I appreciate you watching. And, yeah, sorry, I'm out of here.